Claire. Hello everyone, my name is Diva. And my name is Claire. And we're here to do another snack crate box. I think this is the bigger one. I'll have to put up how much I paid and how many pieces came in it right next to us. Um, but let's see what we received and try out some new snacks. And there's 20 of them, 21 inside this box. Apparently, yeah, we got a bigger one this time. Like a family size one or something yeah. this time. Okay, so this is what they sent us. Whoa. Interesting. I don't know if we requested this. Anyway, this is snacks from Hong Kong. I never heard of that before. Okay, can I pick the first one? So anyway, we received a couple cards that have what items you receive and um, how to make sweet and sour pork recipe. Yeah. And the first thing I pulled out is this weird Cheetos. What does it say? Okay, weird Cheetos. Okay, so these are called Cheetos Steak Flavor. Hold them up to the camera so people can see. This bag is giving other Cheetos a run for their money, ditching the classic cheese flavor and replacing it with a sa savory Japanese barbecue steak flavor. <laughs> Do you want to see if it tastes good? It's hard. Is it hard to open? Oh, they made these well. Hmm. Much, wow, much harder to get into than our chips. Okay. All right, so try that yeah, out. Yeah, they look weird. They, look they do like, look kind of weird. They look Oh, wow, they don't have cheese on them, so they look really weird. Mmm, it's not bad. Hmm. I don't know how to describe that flavor, but it's kind of oniony. It's kind of good. Do you like that? Wait, this is, oh no. So let's put this Mom, over here. Mom, this is, mm. this is flaming hot. Oh, flaming hot? What does it look like, that one? Mm -hmm. Okay, these are H-E Double Hockey Sticks potato chips. Mm -hmm. Beware, these super spicy potato chips are not for the faint hearted. This crispy snack will take your taste buds to H-E Double Hockey Stick and back. Hold on, I'm going to be right back Where are you here. going? I need to get water. No, you don't need any water. This is flaming hot. Flaming hot. It cannot do. It can't open it again. These are hard. These yeah. are hard to open. Wow, I might need to get a scissors. Scissors? Um, I don't dare to. Oh, eat. they're like regular potato chips. See? Yeah. Oh boy. <clears throat> I'll be all right. You don't like it? I put it back. Mm -hmm. I don't really like it because it's so spicy. Mm. Okay, super spicy flavor. Doesn't say what causes the spice. Wait, this is animal. It's a cat. Oh, oh I want to open it. Eey, let's find out what this is. Dream Animal Biscuits. Ooh. Each of these crunchy animal-shaped biscuits represents one of the vegetables you would find in a fresh garden salad. Oh, like a, I got a cat. It says lynx. I have a lynx. A fur seal. What's a fur? What's a lynx? Mm. A cat? A lynx is a kind of cat. Mm. It's made with dehydrated vegetables, so wait, it's healthy for you. Wait, it kind of tastes <laughs> like animal crackers. Yeah, and it's animal crackers with vegetables in it, so Claire would really like to have those. Next one. What is this? Okay, we'll have to we'll have to revisit this. We'll come back to that one. Okay. Mm. What is what is? Wait, I have no idea what we ordered. I wanted this. Wait, this looks like a marshmallow. Oh, I have a kitty in the front. Oh, it's a marshmallow treat. Okay, let's split let's it. Let's find out what it is. Let's split it. Wait. Oh, mommy has chocolate. Oh, okay. Here we go. There might be another one in here. Oh. See? Mommy, oh. has, mommy has chocolate. Wow. Okay. Dessert. 
This is called a Four Seas Daifuku, a fresh take on a traditional Japanese wagashi. This soft marshmallow snack has a creamy chocolate filling that spills out with every bite. Mom, Do you want me to try one? Yeah. Do you think I'll like it? Yeah, this, this is so good. Mm-hmm. Well, if I go to Chinese, it's that your... it's a, Mom, if I go to Chinese, that will be my favorite food. You gotta say, oh look, look what else he gave you. <gasps> no! Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. Mom, we should. Mom, you should have this one, and I can have this one. Uh oh, there it goes. It's okay. I will pick it up later. Okay. So, what do you want to try next? What is this? Those were a winner, weren't they? Yeah. It's the next thing, guys. It's the next thing. Okay. What is it? All right. This? Um. What is that? <laughs> oh, here we go. Want want crackers? What a creative name. These crispy fried rice cracker balls are coated with a slightly sweet and spicy seasoning. No! Making them the perfect afternoon snack. I thought you liked spicy. I do, but not that mm. much. Okay. Okay. <laughs> They're cra rice cracker balls. I think they're not that spicy. Mmm. Because it's sweet and spicy. It's a very, um... Wait, it kind of looks like those breads that we have, like, from, from, like, wait, it kind of tastes like, hmm, that's very unique flavor. Mm -hmm. Next thing. I don't know how to describe it. Wait, this is kind of like the, Roller what? Coaster Mini. Mom, remember the, mm. these are kind of like, like the rings that we had last time. Those do look like those little rings we had. If you're looking for a wild ride, jam-packed, with flavor, these roller coaster crunchy potato rings are for you. This snack is dusted with savory barbecue seasoning to keep you coming back for more. Those look just like the rings we got from the the UK one, huh? Mm -hmm. Well, these are tiny. But they're tiny ones? What do they taste like? Look how tiny. I know. They're babies. They're babies. Mm-hmm. Mm, not bad. Um, I don't know. Wait, the kind of taste is like... It's like a sweet mom, barbecue. Mom, the kind of taste is like those chips that you got, that those potato chips that I loved. Oh, okay. You love those potato chips? Well, they're still... Whoa. That's a big package. Guys, look how big this package is. Whoa. Popping candy. Similar to the popping candy you know and love, only a hundred times better. Shovel in a mouthful of and experience a cola flavored, brain rattling sensation. <coughs> Ooh. Did you get it? Yeah. Oh. Ooh, there's packets. So we'll try a little packet, huh? Uh, wait, this I think this is like mm. red flavored. Red flavor? Yeah. It's cola flavor, it says. Uh, can you help me? Here you go. Like Pop Rocks, right? Mm -hmm. Welcome. Mmm. Uh. You don't mm. really taste good. Because they're soda flavored and you don't like soda, right? It's a good thing. Wait, there's one more. I see something that has... Whoa. Oh, these are more marshmallows. Okay. Those are called Dragon Beard Candy. And they're popular among the locals of Hong Kong. This traditional Chinese candy is 100% handmade and features a slightly sweet exterior with a nutty almond center. I already showed the camera. You already showed the camera? Okay, can I open it? Well, I want to use the scissors so that we can well, rip open the box. Remember, guys, to subscribe and like, and I hope you give us a lot, lot of likes. 
All right. That's, that's a weird package. Yep, but remember this is handmade candy, okay? I never tried this before. Wait, that's yours. I know, I'm gonna keep it over there with everything. Oh, this is weird looking. <laughs> Wait, they kind of look like little cupcakes. <laughs> it's really strange looking. Dragon beer, okay. Is this all Ew! Like, you eat it. Oh, this is very strange. It looks like some kind of like, I don't know, wrapped mummy or something. Like there's peanut butter inside. I'm not a fan of this at all. I mean, it doesn't taste bad. <laughs> it tastes like hair. I know. from Claire. Mom, there's peanut butter inside. Well, it tastes like almond, so I think it's, and there's peanut in it. Desiccated coconut, almond flavoring, tapioca starch. I have no idea what's making it taste like hair, though. It's whatever, I think it's the desiccated coconut. Look. That looks like a beard. Okay, it's good. It's just very strange. That's a cold pocket. I mean, it's just very strange. Here's the next thing. Yeah. Okay. Nobody likes the stringy stuff. This is the next thing that I pulled out. Okay. Curry flavored chips. Wait, Do you like curry? Look, they look like paper, like um, tomatoes. No, not tomatoes. Savory, crunchy potato chips that are coated in a distinctly Asian-inspired curry powder, making them of the most craveable snacks in the box. Okay, and I'm very excited about these. Why? Because I like curry stuff. Mm. It's a thick chip, right? Or just a regular chip? It's spicy. It's spicy! Mmm. It's spicy. Okay. Really? It's curry powder, so it's got some... That's a big chip. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Well, there's still a lot of stuff. I like me. those. Oh, I want to mm. try this one next. This looks... Oh, oh gummy! Okay, so... Wait, it's an easy one. Look. You can, Mom, look, look. Yeah. It's an easy one. Look. Okay, easy to tear open. Mixed berry pastilles. These soft pastilles have a vibrant berry flavor that floods your mouth with fruity delight. Made with real black currant juice, this snack is not only tasty, but is also a great source of vitamin C. This might be the healthiest thing in here. You think so? Come on, it's not really healthy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There you go. This is oh, I like it. Mmm. Yeah, mm. this is the best. You like that? That's really good. Mm -hmm. Show them what it looks like. It's got like some kind of sugar coating. It's kind of squishy. It's kind of squishy, right? It is kind of squishy. Do you want to try these wafers? Wait, I like them. I know, these look so good. Like, I am so excited about wafers. <laughs> Mom, there's a lot of stuff I like. Garden cream wafer. Well, let me know what you like. Vanilla wafers and bite into the smooth strawberry cream filling for a truly blissful experience. I'm gonna eat one of these again. Okay. And then I'm gonna have one of those. Is that your dessert? <laughs> oh, yum. Wafers. There's a wafer. Oh, there's two, right? These look really yummy. Mmm. 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 Really interesting. Mm hmm. You like that? Yeah. It kind of like has like a strawberry <clears throat> feeling inside and a cracker. And this stuff, honestly, I know it has cornstarch and real sugar, but. This stuff, not to be funny, but this stuff actually tastes like real fruits and stuff in it. Yeah. Like, it doesn't taste artificial like you would find in 
our food. And it definitely does not have corn syrup and stuff like our food has. So all these flavors like taste natural despite being junk food kind of things. Mm. The strawberry is really fresh and um, light. Uh, what is, oh, this is, I don't know if we can, like, hmm. Um, Wait, oh, here it is. Mama, it Ninja says... Gummy Cola. Oh, <laughs> uh -huh. I like cola. <clears throat> Not your average gummy. This unique candy has a semi-hard shell surrounding a soft, sparkling, cola-flavored center. This ninja is all business when it comes to flavor. Oh, what is this color? It's cola, so you probably will not like the flavor that much. But it's like a little... I can't really eat it. I know. I mean... Yeah. Fructose glucose syrup. I can't really eat it. Fermented milk. Mm -mm. I like that. It's really gooey. And gummy like I wasn't joking when it said it was a gummy like it wasn't a fruit snack it was a real gummy mm -hmm. and I'm still chewing it down Get the next okay these are called um, hold it up Pretz roast biscuits these instantly recognizable biscuit sticks are buttery slightly sweet and have the perfect snack. Put this in one your, in your bag for your perfect afternoon snack. There's two mm. packs. Oh, this is gonna make a total mess. Oh, this open one. Oh, I know, but that will make a total mess. Mm. Buttery. I was not joking when it said buttery. And it kind of like has like salt on it or cheese. Yeah, it tastes like somebody just like melted butter on um a stick. Yeah. You don't like that? No, yeah. no, no. Mm -mm. Um, Mama, I'll taste, probably eat it. Mama, but it kind of tastes like 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 those dipping ones, like you dip like the thing in tight like the butter or something. Oh, okay. I like it, so I'll probably end up eating it. Another one I don't know if you like. Um, um, that one is, oh, show it to the camera. Shy Kicks, which I have no idea how I pronounce that. Sour candy, pucker up. If you can survive the super sour layer of this cone I don't like candy. sour. You'll be rewarded by the sweet flavors of the Japanese ume plum. I don't so let's see if we can survive I, I the think, sour. I don't think I would like it. Mm. Oh my god. That's not more sour than a warhead. <laughs> and it's like a gross sour. Oh my goodness. No, keep it. There's a plum. Hmm, the ume plum isn't bad. Yeah, but the sour part is not good. Hmm, the ume plum is very light and floral. I like that. Oh, I want to try this one. Well, I will eat that one then. What is that one? Shima Pucho Stick. This soft yogurt based candy is loaded with bits of two I sold chewy it. I sold it. grape flavored gummies and each bite yields a fruity supply so you like grape it's true so you eat that right oh i can just easily just rip it oh there's different ones so I like this is a long video because we have a lot of stuff to eat don't we this looks like gum oh, okay uh -oh. my kind okay, looks like gum Oh, Mama, it does look like gum. Oh, does it look like gum? It's oh, a yogurt based Wait, thing. Mom, it has, like, it inside. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Mm. A lot of stuff inside. 
That's delicious. So that's really good, but it's really chewy, so. Okay. Be prepared. <laughs> okay. Alright, this one's called a high chew. Okay. Let me see. High chew peach. The satisfying chewy Asian candy classic you all know and love. Now in a bright fruity peach flavor. This popular treat is a true summer delight. So let's try peach. A weird color. It's peach flavor. Yeah, but it looks like a weird color. Yeah, it's gonna be chewy. Mmm. 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 And once again, it tastes very natural. Mmm. 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 Hold on the camera. Mamie, monster noodle snack. <laughs> okay. Crunch it, shake it, munch it. This noodle snack is meant to be eaten dry. Break it up and pour on the seasoning packet for a completely new snacking experience. So instead of... It's so crackers it's a monster. So instead of heating it up in a pot of water, you crunch it up. <clears throat> and then you eat it. When it's, is it done? Mm -hmm. Wait, I noticed that, wait, mm -hmm. it's a face on the back. Mm -hmm. Let's see if look, it has a face on the back. It comes with a seasoning pattern. Do you want a seasoning packet or no? What is the seasoning packet? Um, It's really interesting. It's nice noodle, dry out noodle. Yeah. Mm. Mm. There it goes. Do you like it? Mm. Make sure you really Can I have the and pack it? Mm -hmm. And then we have to crush it up and so we have a jam in and I don't know if you're going to want the seasoning packet. What it smells like. Maybe try that piece with it. Indulge yourself with these delicious and luscious Kinder Milk chocolates filled with sweet and smooth milk cream. This treat might just be the hardest to share. And that's Claire's favorite thing is Kinder. It has four, so. Mm -hmm. Mom, I would like for you to have my treat. You're a treat. <laughs> All right, I don't mind trying. Wait, it's melting. Oh no. Well, let's eat it before it melts too much. It's still melting. It's mm. kind of melted a little bit. Mmm! It tastes like your Kinder eggs that you like? <laughs> no, just one because we're going to eat dinner. Hey. Mmm. Another dessert. Wait, it kind of has like a... <gasps> Mom has marshmallow in the flare way. Mmm. Crackers. Hold it up. A flaky, buttery malt cracker with a perfect snap. This unique treat features a sweet layer of brulee sugar on top, giving graham crackers a run for their money. I like a hot one in my life sometimes. Yeah? It'll tell me. Mom, it's sticky. Mm hmm. It's got brulee sugar. Mmm, it tastes like crackers. I would like to have this in my lunch. Mmm. It does kind of remind me of a graham cracker. It's really interesting. It's like a 
saltine with sugar on it. Mm. <laughs> Last but not least thing. All right, please don't press on it because they recommend you putting it in the refrigerator, but we're not. Because mm -hmm. we're going to not try it right now. Mm -hmm. All right, so what we got sent was... The cold pack is no longer in service, but this is a Meiji gummy choco, sweet and chewy bite sized strawberry, oh she hold it up, gummies coated in a thick layer of rich milk chocolate. Think of this snack like a chocolate coated raisin's cooler older sibling. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Wait, I want to open it. This one's a little hard. Wow. Hmm. Oh, those are little chocolate. Hmm. Hmm. This is really good. Is it good? Mm -hmm. The strawberry chocolate strawberry gummies. Mm -hmm. Can you take it like weird in the middle? I mean, it's strawberry, but. All right. And that's all of our box? That's all our box. On the bottom, it talks about the things we received. Mm -hmm. And, um, talks about Hong Kong. So, yeah. Anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, everybody. And remember to subscribe and like. <laughs> and be kind, be courageous, and be the best you. Bye. Bye. Ricky, do you want to play? Do you want to play? Come here, tell mommy. You want to play? Okay, show me where you want to play with. Show me which toy you want to play with. Yep, which one? Which one? Which one? Do you want to play with this one? Which one? Which one?